What's going on guys? So in this video we're going to try to figure out which hook out of three different of the most popular style catfish hooks has the best hookup ratio. So how many of you guys have ever missed the fish before? I know that I have. How many of you guys have missed a lot of fish since you've been fishing? I have missed so many. I wish I could go back and get those fish back. So bad. How many of you guys still to this day miss at least probably one every trip? I still do that, guys. I'm still doing that every trip, and it's killing me. So, if you're like me, then stay tuned, because we're going to figure out which hook has the best hookup ratio. Let's head on out to the building real quick and show you guys exactly the setup and everything that we're going to be using to test out these three style different hooks. But, while we head out here, I want to say this. Stay tuned, because there's going to be, at the end of this, there's going to be a $20 value of hooks given away. So, whichever hook turns out to be the best hook has the best hookup ratio. We're going to be giving away $20 worth of that hook to someone. Um, stay tuned. I'll tell you guys how you can do that in the comments later on down in the video. All right, so here we are. We're in the building. Let's see what we're working with. So, like I said, we're going to be doing a giveaway, so you're going to, you're going to want to stay tuned to figure that out. And then, getting right into it, we have the hook. So. We're going to be extremely fair with these, and I'm going to show you guys that as well. But the very first hook, and this is the one that a lot of people start out with. You get the little catfish beginner kits. Uh, a lot of old timers and stuff have this hook, and for a good reason. This is a very good hook. It's the collie hook. Now, this one's a popular one for the last few years, actually, and uh, for good reason. I, I use this a lot, too, so we'll see how that pairs up. It's a 4 aught I don't necessarily use a 4 aught but... We have to use the four hot because we got to be using them exactly the same. Four hot double hot double auction double action circle hook. So here's a, a kind of a newer J hook um, than a lot of the old style J hooks, and a lot of people are starting to switch to it. It is the Jackhammer J hook from Team Catfish. It is four hot too. Now here's the thing: all three of these hooks, you can go back and look. Or I'll show you guys again real quick. All three hooks have a straight up eye that none of the eyes are offset. And they all have an offset to them, meaning that if you look at down the eye, then the point of the hook is offset from the eye of the hook. So guys, let's get into what we're going to be using. So I really, really want this to be as accurate as possible because I want to really figure out which one has the best. So I'm going to put a lot of time into this. And I want to figure it out for you guys and for me. I know I'm tired of catching fish, missing fish, and I know you guys probably are too sometimes. So what I'm going to do is I've got this eight foot ugly stick here and I've got three of these they're exactly the same they're all ugly sticks they're all even white colored and they're all eight foot same action everything now here's something else we're gonna be doing all of these three poles have 40 pound mono exact same 40 pound mono on it now we've got the exact same lead weight on it three ounce we've got a barrel swivel we've got the bobber for Santa Cooper rig, and then a couple inches down, we have our hook. We're going to run that same rig with all three setups. Now, here's something else we're going to do. We're going to tie, you generally I'll tie the snail knot, but none of, the, because like this one is offset. None of those ho eye hooks are offset, so we're going to tie the exact same knot with all three. We're going to tie the improved clinch knot with all three of those. So, and then... Last but not least, I think this is very well overlooked. We are going to be using shad. We're going to be using cut bait. So let me ask you guys this. Would it be accurate for me to put a head on this one, a middle section of the cut on the other one, and the tail on the other one? That kind of be it? I don't think so. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut it, and I'm going to try to save the rest of those pieces for other fishing trips. And I'm only going to say use the head on all three of them. I'm going to cut the same size heads and I'm going to hook them the exact same way using the exact same chunk of bait. So we're about to get into the giveaway, how you guys can win this, and then also at the very end of the video you're going to learn about how to win $25 in cash giveaway in Friday's video. So you're going to want to stay tuned to that and get an early sneak peek of what's going to happen and how you can win $25 cash in Friday's video. So, um... <clears throat> I'm going to be doing this right here for probably the next couple months because I want some really good results. I want some very good testing, some uh, multiple tests. I don't just want to go out on one trip and say, oh, I think this one's the best. So what you guys are going to see is you're going to see a playlist of this start dropping. every uh, So often you're going to start seeing videos pop up in that playlist 
about this, figuring out which one has the best hookup ratio. We're going to do this, on the, like I said, over the next couple months, and uh, I'd like to get at least 10 to 15 bites on each hook. And uh, <clears throat> when we do that, we'll, we'll, we'll probably decide the winner. So we're going to shoot for 15. 15 bites on every hook and see what which one gets the most hookup ratio and like i said it's going to be fair as crap but let's get into the giveaway how can you guys start off win twenty dollars worth of hooks well of the best hook actually um what you got to do is for one you got to be subscribed you got to go into the comments and this is important the very first word you need to say in the comment is vote directly after that you need to say the style of hook so let's go back over the hooks real quick so you guys don't have to rewind the video say you want this j hook to win or you think it's going to win you are going to say vote jack camera so if you think it's going to be the circle hooks you're going to say vote double action or vote circle hook if you think it's going to be the collie hooks you're going to say vote collie now, what's going to happen is I'm going to tally up all the ones, and uh, we're going to have a lot of fun doing this, uh, testing these out. Whichever is the most popular, which meaning whichever hook was voted to, to win the most, is going to be called the favorite. So when we're out there fishing and testing these out, only you guys that are subscribed that's watched this video is kind of going to get an understanding of what I'm saying sometimes because I'm going to hook it and I'm going to say there's one on the favorite or I just missed one on the favorite people coming in aren't necessarily going to know what we're talking about so it's going to be a little inside thing for us um, the one that is the least popular is going to be the underdog so when I hook up one on the run I'm like oh my gosh there's one on the underdog you know it's going to be a lot of fun and the middle one is going to be of course called the middleman and you guys are only going to be the ones who understand that so at the end of the series, whichever hook wins the competition, whichever one comes out victorious, has the best hookup ratio. So I'm going to take and pick, go through this video and figure out everybody that picked the circle hook, for say, if it won. Um, and I'm going to put you all in a name, let my boy or my girl draw your name out. And we'll probably do that on live so everything is uh, legit. And be sending you guys $20 worth of hooks. So now let's get into the next video next week's video and figure out a little bit about $25 cash giveaway all right guys so Christmas is almost coming up and I kind of wanted to do a giveaway so I figured man I'm, I'm, I've been trying to do something and I cannot get it I cannot figure it out my on my own and I need your help so it's almost Christmas I'm gonna do a giveaway $25 cash giveaway <laughs> Everybody likes cash, right? No one can complain about cash. So I'm going to give away cash because I really want everyone to be involved in this because I need help. Like I said, it's drove me crazy. I've done so much research trying to figure this out. All you're going to be doing is leaving something. I'm going to ask you guys something, and you guys are going to leave it in the comments. I'm going to go through and pick out my favorite. So there's a little bit of hint. So here's exactly what you got to do.